how to find a web developer job near me in this video we're gonna go in and show you guys the best websites to actually look for jobs when you are a web developer so let's get started with the first one so the first one that we have right here is indeed.com now indeed.com you can see that is basically one of like the top websites when it comes to job listings you can come here and search for titles right let's say web developer you can search for that and you can search for a specific area now I live in the Tampa Bay area so I'm gonna search for Tampa and basically you can see that it will give you all of the job listings right here sometimes it will tell you you know what's the range between 45 67 thousand dollars a year right sometimes you're gonna find um, you know information where there's some high paying jobs and some listings might not even tell you how much they're actually willing to pay okay uh, but you can use indeed.com it's a great website okay one thing that I like about indeed is that you can search specific by the title by using this you could say title colon and then that will make sure that it will only find uh, those jobs that you are actually looking for so for example if I'm looking for web developer it will only search for those jobs that it has the web developer in the title and this is great for when you're trying to find something like uh, PHP developer right which is a specific language a specific skill that you might be looking for okay so it could be PHP developer it could be uh, Python developer right and it will give you all of the results right there okay so that's a little trick that you guys can get um, from using indeed.com another website that we have is uh, basically dice.com so dice.com is a specific uh, job board where it's just for uh, tech careers basically okay this is one of the oldest websites that uh, were targeted just for IT workers and, and you know tech workers programmers etc and you can find a lot of jobs in here uh, you can search for let's say uh, web developer right you could search for things like react developer okay and you will see that it will give you some pretty good listings okay and sometimes the listings that you will find here you won't find them on indeed.com so when you're looking for a job this is a great place where you can start with uh, because it's catered to us you know tech workers now the next one that we have here is ZipRecruiter and ZipRecruiter is one that they're constantly promoting like on podcasts on YouTube or on, you know advertising on the radio and it's because it basically allows a company to post it here once and then they post it everywhere else so it's a really great platform and for you who is the person looking for a job you can find the jobs directly in here uh, that maybe you won't find in indeed.com or even on dice.com because maybe they might not have posted it there right but at least ZipRecruiter has a huge database of, of, of jobs so I'm gonna come in here I'm gonna search for HTML I always recommend people to search for HTML in your area uh, because that's where you're gonna find all of those jobs that maybe uh, you wouldn't have thought that you had access to or maybe you didn't think that you could apply to uh, sometimes when you're going just for the titles you know you could be limiting yourself for the different type of positions like for example if I was a web developer and all I searched was web developer maybe I wouldn't get this job listing at city now the next one that we have right here is glassdoor.com and glassdoor is really cool because what it allows you to do is to search for jobs but then you could also see how much people are getting paid in that same position that you're going for and maybe get a review of the company okay it gives you a salary range and also too you could see like reviews of like the companies so let me see if I could find one so let's say let's see if we search Google right click on Google okay you can see the reviews people have put for this company all right and then from there you have all of the job listings that Google might have right now and you can see them right here you can see 66k salaries okay so you can see all of the different ones like software engineer how much a software engineer is making at Google so you can see that pay range okay cash bonus stock bonus uh, 
commission sharing tips. I don't, I don't know who's paying tips <laughs> at Google, uh, but I guess somebody's getting tipped. Uh, another one is like you can see here the, the average, right? So this is pretty cool. Okay, but to be honest, my favorite now is Google. So if you go to jobs.google.com, you can actually come here to this page, right? I'm going to show you guys right here like that, jobs.google.com, and it will bring you here. You click here, view live, okay? And that will basically do like a search result for you. Um, and you can search jobs near me. You could do it directly through there. And it will give you this little box right here, okay? And it will show you jobs that are in your area. And, of course, Google already knows your, your location, knows exactly where you're at. So, uh, basically, they'll give you, you know, all of the information about the jobs that's near you, okay? But what's cool about Google is that Google is actually scraping the whole internet, okay? They're going through every single website, and they're finding the jobs that are available to you, okay? So, I could come in here and search web developer all right and automatically it will show me all of the jobs that are in my area as a web developer i can search for specific skills html jobs right and it will show me the nearest ones clearwater new jersey florida atlanta right so it starts giving you everything right uh you could also see react developer jobs Okay, and you can see things like that are remote, right? But if you're looking for a specific in, in an area, uh, it will also show you that. Okay, now what's really cool about this is that it's not just limited to like the jobs that people post, but it's everything, right? So let's say, for example, I wanted to go work at a Rockstar Games. I don't know. Let's say a dream company that you wanted to work for. And you could say Rockstar Games, okay? You come in here and you search for that and Google will find it for you. Okay. We'll find the jobs that are available uh, for Rockstar Games. So let me see. In here, I could search developer, search that. Okay. And automatically it found this job for me. Now, again, if I click in here, you can see all of the different places that you can apply through. Right. You can say hit marker, uh, sun hire, boss hire. So these are different job board listings that's out there for the same position and google basically tells you hey this is all of the places that you can apply for this one specific job so if i click in here it brings me to this marketplace uh hitmarket.com or sorry hitmarket.net and it will give me the job information right um another thing too that you can do is that you can save this i can say okay i want to save this for later right i can save this one for later okay and you can actually uh, get that information later on and, and check those listings. You could also get job alerts. So let's say, for example, I wanted to come here and say, I want React jobs in Tampa. I could click right here and automatically I could set up a job alert and this will send you those jobs every single time that they get posted to your email. Okay. So I got my Joe Santos Garcia email. You could email me if you got any questions or anything. Um, but yeah, you could basically get emailed every single time like a new job listing gets posted. So you could be on top of it. Now you might say, damn, I'm going to get bombarded with emails. No, because they actually go in and, and they put it, you know, package it up together, right? And bundle it up in one email. So you get notification once a day of those new jobs that just got listed. So you could be the first one to apply to it. Okay, this is like a great hack for anybody that's looking to get a job as a web developer. Okay, so this is the best way to find web developer jobs near you. Google, okay, it's that simple. By the way, guys, if you want to support the channel and you enjoy this content, make sure you subscribe, make sure you like this video, and come check out my website, codingphase.com, where we don't teach coding as a hobby. We teach code, right, and programming and becoming a web developer with results. We try to get you a bag. What's the bag? A bag of money. Okay. And how you get a bag of money? By getting higher, by being able to freelance, by being able to create your own apps, your own themes, your own digital products, make money with the skills that you already have. Okay. We teach you everything that you need to become a developer and we focus on jobs. Okay. 
job skills that are in high demand. That's what we focus on. You could get started with literally 20 bucks and it gives you access to a whole bunch of courses. Now, of course, if you want to upgrade to the yearly subscription. You can do that. Okay. But even with the monthly subscription, you can see you got so much value, so much courses just for 20 bucks. Pretty much everything that you need to become a web developer is at a $20 level, like literally like you go to McDonald's and you could afford this, right? So technically you get a lot for your buck. Okay. Um, and then from there you could do the yearly subscription when you're ready. If you want to come in and you have, uh, things that you want to get answers, you want to have a community that is also behind you and helping you out. You want to get access to accountability meetings where we do live meetings every Sunday. You know, when we go in, we answer questions, we help people directly. We try to create a, a customized, you know, path for you to become a developer and get you hired as soon as possible. Upgrade to the yearly. But again, if you just care about the courses, 20 bucks, get started. All right, guys, I'm going to see you guys later. It's your boy Joe back at it again. CodingFace.com. Peace.